Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be creating a Wes Anderson themed snail mail, more specifically Moonrise Kingdom. I really adore this video. It's just so good. The characters I love and I just really like the colour palette that Wes Anderson uses throughout the video. So I've matched this entire themed snail mail to the colour palette and the really great thing about it is I found lots of beautiful papers throughout the Flo and Frankie magazine. So majority of this mail is created just by using printouts that I printed at Officeworks and also the cutouts that I've taken out of the Flo and Frankie magazine. Now the reason that I'm creating this mail today is because I was going through all my subscriber mail. As being, I have been sorting through them all and I stumbled along one of the letters from, I'm pretty sure her name's Biba from the UK. Sorry if I pronounced that wrong. But in her letter, she said that she really would wanted to see a Wes Anderson themed snail mail. And I thought it was such a good idea. I've actually been wanting to do this idea for a really long time now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create an entire series. So on my channel, I'm going to create a playlist called Wes Anderson. And the next two videos I'm most likely going to make are the Grand Budapest Hotel. More specifically, I want to use the pinks and blues out of the bakery. So the Mendeley's Bakery. And I also want to create next also a video on um, revolving around the life aquatic with Steve Zizou. Um, so those are the two next videos I most likely want to make. But please let me know what your favourite Wes Anderson film is in the comments below and what you would like to see me create. And if you have any ideas for these videos, do let me know because I would love some inspiration off you guys as well. I also am... I'm also really looking forward to um, going through all these letters and sorting through all my pen pals that I've been replying to. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to write a list of 10 to 15 people that I've said yes to you being their pen pal and I'm going to reply more frequently. The reason I haven't been is just because I've I just work really long hours. I'm working Monday to Friday and I leave at around 6.30 in the morning and come back at around 6.30 at night. So I just don't have a lot of time at night time for other things after I've cooked dinner um, and done all the house chores. And I've also recently joined a gym because I want to focus on my health. Just because after getting this office job, I feel like I haven't really been focusing on me lately. I'm still trying to upload these videos weekly and I just haven't had time to actually sit down and write proper letters and I feel like I've just been really overwhelmed just because adapting to a new job like an office job where you're working long hours and it takes me around 45 minutes to an hour to get to work each day so it's not an it's not a short commute at all so just yeah I just I've just really been trying to work on myself like my health and trying to figure out more of a better routine for myself. So unfortunately that meant that I've had to put letter writing aside for a bit. I have still been ensuring that I've been uploading weekly my videos, but I've just been a terrible pen pal to most people and I do apologize. But what I'm gonna have to do is, I know I said I was gonna reply back to a lot of my mail, but I was sorting through it today and I have hundreds of letters and I just can't commit to that. And I've just felt really overwhelmed and it actually gave me a little bit of anxiety um, when I knew I had that many letters to reply back to. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose 10 to 15 people that I can actually spend my time putting a lot of effort into each letter. And I want to ensure that I'm being a good pen pal. So I'm so sorry to anyone who doesn't really get on my list. But what I'm going to do also is I'm going to open back up my... P.O. box to anyone who wants to send me letters and I'm going to do something similar to what Vivian from the paper letter blog does and I'm going to choose one person from each month to reply back to so if you guys want to send me subscriber mail again I absolutely love receiving them it's really 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 fun to open up all your letters and read your beautiful stories but unfortunately I just won't be able to reply back to everyone just because I literally just don't have the time and when I am trying to reply back to everyone I 
tend to not do the best that I could possibly do and I really do enjoy making something that's really nice to get in the mail and if I'm just trying to reply back to everyone I, I tend to start like f factory working it so it seems to be sort of like a production line like I'm just trying to get them out in mass production which isn't what I like to do I like to ensure that there's a beautiful theme and that I put a lot of effort into letter and I'm actually answering your questions properly and telling you about my life so I'm gonna have 10 to 15 pen pals from now on in probably more likely 15 just depending on when I'm going through all these letters I'm going to make sure that I've I'm replying back to the people who I've already started replying back to and I will let you guys know that list later down the track once I've sorted all that out and organized my all my letters so I won't publicly announce that I'll most likely just reach out to the people that I have or I might just give a first and location, like a first name and a location, just so you guys know if you're on the list or not. I know that sounds like really exclusive, but I just can't commit to mass, like mass, like numbers. Like I've got, like I said, like a hundred letters that I'm trying to sort through, and it, it, I just can't get to it. So I do apologize if I don't reply back to your letter. I know a lot of you have written me letters where you have said in the letter that you don't mind if I don't reply back, you just enjoy doing it, which I do really appreciate. So I will open my PO box back up for subscriber mail. And I'll do what Vivian does in the paper letter blog, how she just chooses one person each month that she replies back to. And I think that's a really good way of doing it. Um, I really like that system. So just getting back to the video, I majority of this video is literally just created by Flo and Frankie magazine ripouts. Also, as I mentioned previously, I got a lot of the printouts from Officeworks. The quality wasn't that great. If I was to do it again, I would have put them on a Word doc and then printed them on paper. Just because printing them on Photostock just didn't look nice at all. But lesson learnt for next time. And then I just got some cardstock, sewed it together with some twine and then started designing on it. I found this letter really fun. I loved using Wes Anderson's colour palette. And I'm looking forward to the series that I'm going to be creating over the next few months. What I'm going to do is I'm not going to be up uploading this series, like the Wes Anderson themed mail, one after the other. I'm going to do it probably more every two to three weeks I'll create one of those videos. Just because I like to have a little bit of variety throughout my videos. And I still have lots of hauls for you guys and lots of mail coming up soon. And in my next video I will be announcing the winner from the giveaway I hosted last week. So I'm really excited about that. Lots of entries, which is exciting. And I'm also going to be creating a space themed mail next. And it looked really good when I created it today. I created both of them beforehand. So I really enjoyed creating that too. And I, yeah, I think that's it that I wanted to talk to you guys about today. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you liked the theme. Oh, I forgot to mention, I really want to see your video your sorry your create your Wes Anderson creation so if you do create any Wes Anderson mail please tag me on Instagram I would love to see it and I'm sure everyone else would love to see it too so if you want to go see Wes Anderson theme mail go to my tag section on Instagram and hopefully people will start putting tagging me in their video their photos so I can see the mail and it can all come up on my tag feed on my Instagram um, if you don't know where it is, just Google your tagged feed and you should see that on your Instagram page. Did that make sense? I started rambling there because I forgot to add that in. So I would love to see any recreations of this video. Please tag me on Instagram and if anyone else makes any other mail of any other, the, any other Wes Anderson films, please tag me. I would love to see them all on Instagram. So that was the last thing I just wanted to mention today. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I had so much fun making it and little mail art on the envelope was super fun as well. Thanks again for watching. Bye. <laughs>